We're at RhinoTech today. What we're going to be doing is talking about a brand new stencil system that is just becoming out, will be coming out in the market shortly. It is a way where we can make a stencil on our screen such as this one here with no film positive, no coating of a screen, no drying time of that capillary film or direct emulsion, no exposure time, and no developing of that screen. And again, of course, that drying time. What we do is create our artwork as you normally would. However, instead of printing out a film positive and or multiple film positives, one for each of the colors, you print them out in a negative on this transfer paper. What this is is using a laser printer. Remember, it only has to be black. Or a copier, a laser copier. You can actually print these out. We've created our artwork. We've created it, printed it in a negative. At this point, we want to marry it with a transfer sheet. What this will do is lay a coating of adhesive onto the surface wherever it was black, wherever that toner is black. And I might add that this is standard toner. We do this in our heat press at 250 degrees for 25 seconds. Once we've done that for the 25 seconds, we're going to want to take that and immediately do a hot peel. It's self-weeding product so that everywhere that it was a black toner, it will weed out and put down um, your adhesive, even down to 10-point lettering at this point. We now take it and separate the two, creating what will end up being our stencil on a screen. You can see that it now has a gray coating versus where it was black. That's obviously the adhesive. The next step is to actually put it onto the surface of that screen. What we're using again is going to be a heat press. We put down a release paper. That's to absorb any adhesive going through so that we don't get it down onto the bed. At that point, we take our screen. We can lay it right in here and straddle our bed. Lay our stencil in position. And heat press that down for 25 seconds at 375 degrees. At this point, when it's concluded, all you want to do is let it cool down. That will take anywhere from three to five minutes. At that point, we can strip off the carrier sheet and we have our screen. We now have our screen ready to go. Obviously, this is too hot at this point. However, this one has cooled down, and all we do is peel it off, creating our stencil on the surface. It's that simple. At this point, block it out, and you're ready to print. If it's a multicolor job, obviously you do it the same way you would traditionally do it with film positives by putting your registration marks in the corner, but printing it in a negative format.